How's all doing? It's Barry here again for Central Scotland's Buried Past. I'm out on a new field of mine uh, today, a spot of metal detecting. It's absolutely huge. I've got maybe three tractors wide there, uh, cut already. Uh, there's another three fields over the way there. They're absolutely massive. I've got years and years of digging here. Uh, so I'm just out the daily light here, be quick recce, find out where's where. See if I can find anything old. Uh, according to the Canmore maps, there's quite a bit of archaeology found at the top of the hill. Unfortunately, it's a climb to get to it, but I will get there. So I'm going to head up there and do a couple of lamps up the top end, see what we can find, and I'll get back to you on the first hole there. Eh? suppose I better start the climb. So we've got good numbers here, they're awfully low. Somewhere. 65, 66. It's quite low numbers, but yeah, I'm going to dig it anyway since it's a new field and I'll get back to you in a second. No need to even dig it, it's on the surface. Something's been popping some pills on the hill. Got another good signal here. Dig it, see what it is. Need to say any more. Hope it's not going to be like this. All day. That's me up the top of this hill. What a climb. You can certainly see the vantage point up here. You can see for miles. Blackstone Dyke and runs the length for the field. This field used to be cut into like 12 different fields, according to the medieval maps, anyway. Beautiful. Anyway, on the way up, never really found much. Got a pocket full of junk. Uh, trying to think what else. Nothing actually. A bit of lead, white lead. I got tons of them uh, cattle tubes and sheep dips. Cracking signals you get as well. But uh, no, nothing really of age whatsoever. But I stopped. I'm hardly detecting them. Start and stop them, start and stop them. One pence. There must be a dog walker or something's dropped it. I'm not too sure what that is. But yeah, nothing really interesting. But I've only walked up that inside line. One length. Jeez, you can't expect much with one length. As you can see with the last video and this video, this from at the top now, there's literally acres upon acres upon acres. Ideally, you want to just go straight down through the middle, go around the edges, a couple of stars across the, the fields, but we'll get to it, we'll get to it. I'm too minds what to do. <laughs> Climbed all the way up here. We've got to have a wee nosy about these oak trees here, a bit random. Right at the top of the hill. Beautiful views. So first finds out at the top of the hill here. I don't know if you can see it. The sun's beginning to go down. I think there's a coin. Yep. Give me a little second to clean it up, I'll get back to you. Yeah, it's blank. It might be a turn of, it's turn of size and waver thin. Maybe when it dries off and I get it home, I'll have another look. Never mind, on to the next. Got no too bad a signal here. 
Astaga, si Oko. Si ya. Oh ya, saya akan. Nah, fungsi saya ada sekolah red brown flag kan dia akan. No, just a washer. I'll get a wee clean up because sometimes it can be coins. So it is a coin. The officer just put a, a hole through it. I don't know, it's a keepsake. Maybe around a necklace. It's hard to say who it is. But there is writing around one of the edges. And again, it's fairly thin. Alright, on to the next. It's not a good signal here. Higher numbers, eh, uh, oh, where is it? Let's give it a dig, see what it is. There she is. I think it's another coin, maybe a button. Put on, never mind. On the next. Got another target there. Gotta give it a dig. 91, 92. Highest it goes is 94, so that was probably a big bit of lead or something, but I'll get back to you in a minute. So here's the find. It's a belter. I know where it is. It's a big cartwheel penny. This stuff's Great. It's been ploughed maybe two years ago, so it's nice and soft underneath this grass. It's lovely to dig in. Let me see this. Is there any detail on it? Nothing. Get a wee wipe my jeans. You can see a slight bust. That's George of Ford, isn't it? Cartwheel 1790s. A couple of ounces there. Pure copper. Well, that's a great find. There's detail up the sides. No, can't, can't, can't quite catch it. I'll let it dry out. Where it's there. I'll let it dry out and we'll see how it looks. Got a lot of good numbers here. 84, 85, quite deep. Let's give it a dig, see what we've got. Next find up. Not a button. Hmm. Not too sure about that. Nice flower design on the front of it anyway. Never mind, find all the same. Mm. Right, on to the next. How you doing? That's me. I'm going to call it quits for the day. I came out quite late in the day. I've had a wee walk about. Not much came up, but I wasn't expecting that. I let him watch the tractor there and the seagulls catching all the mice on there. So, uh, the mates have given me a phone, so I'm going to dive down the road and spend the night with them. However, I'll finish the video off, I was out with Mark four days, five days ago, so uh, I'll put a video up of that, let you all see how we go on. Uh, until next time, I'll see you all then. Eh? Bye for now.